All right, welcome back. In this lesson, we are gonna do multicolor prints in Prusa Slicer. And to do this, you need to be in Prusa Slicer 2.2, so make sure you have the latest download. So please, 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 please make sure you have Prusa Slicer 2.2 or you won't be able to do this. So let's go ahead and add our model. We'll add the base. And there we go. And for the settings, we're gonna do 0.2 millimeter layer heights and three shells. So that's good. Let's go back to the platter and then let's go ahead and slice it up. So to add color changes or color stops, uh, that way our printer will stop automatically for us. You just wanna scrub through this until you kind of see the layer that you want to change, make the change on. So I'm gonna go until I see the text appear bloop, right there. And then what you wanna do is right click this little plus sign right here and you will only see it if you're using Prusa Slicer 2.2. So make sure you have the latest and we're gonna right click and say, add color change. And then it'll ask for a color. We could do you know anything you want. It doesn't really matter because it's not gonna affect our print, but let's say black for dare. And there we go. And then keep on scrubbing up. And then I'm gonna zoom in so I can kind of see when the last uh, layer for the dare is. And it looks like there's about three little triangles, three or four. So let's get it to where I can see the truth and the dare. So I'm looking right here and right here and then just scrub up, so right there. So that's where they're all the same color, and then we'll go to the next layer. All right, there it looks like, maybe this one. It's kind of hard to see with the black. There it is, so one more, there we go. So one more than the layer that it, you think it should be, and then right click, add color change, and let's do red, and there we go. So you should have it just on truth, and then the printer will continue to print. And there you go. So that's a super easy way to get three different colors for your print. And the reason I wanted to show you this is so you don't have to sit around and babysit your printer while you're trying to change colors. Uh, the printer will just automatically stop for you because we added these color change stops. And then you can just resume the print and keep on going. So that'll be two stops in your print. And yeah, hopefully that helps. And again, you don't have to do this. This is just optional. Uh, but I uh, just wanted to show you that it's possible. So hopefully that helps or get your ideas spinning or get you thinking of some ideas for things you can do. And let's go ahead and jump into the next lesson and print that thing.